Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Yuki. For today's video, I am doing a Aritzia clientele haul. This is pretty much everything I got from the clientele sale. I'm really excited to show you guys what I got. There are some really great pieces and there were also some surprises in sizing. So we're gonna get into all of that today. And I have tried all of these items on. Sometimes I open them on camera, but today I couldn't wait. I tried everything on and I'm really excited to share my opinions with you guys so if you're interested in seeing what I got just keep watching and don't forget to subscribe and also keep up with me on Instagram where I show most of the items that I buy yeah let's get started so the first thing that I want to show you guys are socks a subscriber actually recommended these to me and so I picked them up so thank you if you are that subscriber there's a little bit of extra padding where the toes are and also where the heels are which I think is a really good touch I am roasted by my friends for how quickly I go through socks I'm always like breaking the toe of my sock which is super annoying so I always appreciate when there's some extra padding at the toe they're actually super cozy to walk on because of the extra padding I'm really liking these these are really comfortable the next thing I want to show you this one is the Corinne seamless tank it is in black I got it in a small and it's pretty affordable it is only $28 full price super cute cropped knitted halter neck tank that was a mouthful but yeah it's a v-neck definitely very thick but the one problem that I have with this is that the neck part doesn't sit flat on your neck. So for me, like this neck strap always bunches up. So I think I am going to return this one. I do like the quality of this. So it's such a shame because I had such high hopes for this top. I tried this top. Let me know if you have the same problem. Next thing that I got is a pair of Levi Distress denim shorts. These are in the ribcage shorts. And I got these because I tried on the ribcage pants in the past and I really liked how they fit on my waist. There wasn't really a waist gap and it also fit me at my hips. So I knew that these would fit me. I never could buy the pants because they were a little too cropped for my legs. But when I saw the ribcage shorts, I knew that they were going to be perfect. So I got this in a size 25. It is pretty much a perfect fit. My usual size is a 26. They do fit me like a glove right now, but I think over time it's going to stretch out. So I would go one size down for these ones if you want like a really tight fit. And then these aren't super short either, so your butt cheek isn't like hanging out or anything like that. Really loving these, keeping these for sure, and I think it'll just be perfect for summer. So while we're on the topic of shorts, I also picked up the Cozy AF fleece shorts. These are the perfect three inch shorts and I got them in the total eclipse color this time and if you watched my last haul you saw that I got a pair of white ones in a size small but there was just a little too much room in the waist so I decided to go with an extra small this time and just see how that fits but I feel like these now are just a little bit too small shorter and they're also like kind of tight so I feel like these are only good for pajama shorts. Probably will send this one back but it was good to try. So the next thing I want to show you guys is a button up. This one is short sleeve, which is super cute. And it is the boyfriend button up and I have it in a size small. And this is actually on my Instagram highlights. This is one of my picks and I ended up picking it up for myself. As you can tell, like I like my button ups. I've been wearing them a lot this summer. I thought the short sleeve one would be great for when the weather is hotter, but you still want to like have something to cover up with. I really like the white and blue stripes. I think it's a really casual print. The shirt is also like more of a casual soft like material as well. It feels a little bit pilled, but I think it's how it's supposed to be. It's also longer at the back than it is at the front. It's just a really oversized fit in general. And I think that I'm really gonna like this. And yeah, if this is too pricey for you, there are also some other suggestions on my story highlights of ones that look very similar to this, but they're like 50% off. Now, Next thing that I got is this gorgeous blue dress. I am just so in love with this. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen it. I featured this one on my stories and you guys absolutely loved it too. It fits so, so well. It's such a simple dress, but I feel like you can just wear this in so many different occasions. It's a ribbed cotton material. There's also a really high slit, which makes it so flattering, but the slit isn't so high that if it's like a windy day, 
like your whole dress will come up. For me, it still stays like pretty in place because it is kind of a form-fitting dress. And I really love this little like twisted detail at the top. Also like double lines. I do wear stickies when I wear this one, but you could also go braless in it if you wanted to. And last thing, these straps are also adjustable as well. So this one is the Meridian dress. If I didn't mention earlier, I got too excited. And it is in a size small. On to the next thing, which are the effortless pants. Finally found my correct size. It was actually a size zero, believe it or not. That's how big these run. But I actually originally bought a size four for this, but that one was absolutely ginormous. So I sent that one back and sized down to a two. They fit well, but they weren't like a perfect fit. Just slightly loose in the waist, so I thought I would take a chance on the zero. And this one ended up fitting me perfectly. The only thing is that the rise is a little bit tight, but it's not like a huge deal for me. Like I don't have a huge camel toe or anything wearing it. So I'm absolutely just in love with this brown color. I think this will look great with a blouse or even with like a crew neck sweatshirt. The pants are also like very in this season. I'm all about the pleated wide leg trousers. They make you look super tall and they are super high-waisted as well. Any crop top or anything like that is gonna look really, really nice. I I just also love the material so much. Um, I think Aritzia's like crepe material is just fabulous, keeping for sure. But as you can tell, like I still do need to get them hemmed because they are incredibly long. The very last thing I want to show you, it was definitely a splurge. They are a pair of A Goldie jeans. And I've been kind of looking to buy a pair of A Goldie jeans for a while. Like so many people have such great reviews about them. I kind of wanted to also try them for myself. So I ended up picking up the 90s jeans. They are a mid-rise loose fit jean. I ended up going with a size 25 which is one size down from my usual size and these are still ginormous so big i feel like i need to get at like a 23 or something because the waist is just so loose this is how i wish they would fit and maybe the answer is just to get them tailored because i feel like they are designed to be more of a mid-rise fit so the rise might be a little bit smaller too if i order a size down or two sizes down so Maybe I'll just keep them and just get the waist taken in like this. There's some distressing at the knees and it's more of like a straight fit overall. Material wise, they're not super stiff. They definitely have that already worn in look, which I really like. Okay, you guys, so that is everything I got from the clientele sale. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what you got for your clientele sale haul. Follow me on Instagram if you want to keep up with my outfits of the day and what I buy earlier than when I post on YouTube. And as always, I hope you guys all have a really great week and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!